so the final velocity of the particle released in uniform electric field V is equal to Q E by M into T. Now, how much distance this particle can travel in the electric field? We are going to discuss that. This is the final velocity. Therefore, the distance traveled by the particle released in uniform electric field is equal to the distance approach is s what is the kinematic equation of distance s is equal to ut plus half et square it is the kinematic relation which relates the distance and acceleration so therefore we know that u is 0 plus half what is a f by m where a is equal to f by m where f is equal to qe therefore distance is equal to qe t square by R F T square by 2m. See, two relations we got. This is the final velocity approached or attained by the particle which is released in the uniform electric field, QE by m into t. This is the maximum distance a particle can travel in the uniform electric field. What is the equation? QE T square by 2m, where Q is equal to charge, where E is equal to electric field intensity. T is equal to time where m is equal to mass of the particle now we are going to find out the velocity or kinetic energy attained by the particle which is released in the electric field ke attained by the particle which is released in uniform electric field what is the equation of ke half mv square therefore half m is equal to mass what is v just go back to the video qe by k is equal to half mv square half m what is v qe by m into t whole square Therefore, half m into q square, e square, t square by m square. m and m square get cancelled. Therefore, ke of the charged particle when it is released in the uniform electric field is equal to q square, e square, t square by 2m. Where Q is equal to charge, E is equal to electric field intensity, T is equal to time taken, M is equal to mass of the particle which is released in electric field. Now we are going to discuss about the electric flux. The water, amount of water, the content of water which is coming out of a plastic tube whenever electric motor is switched on, that is called flux, that is said to be water flux. Flux means some amount of the force which is coming out of the body. In case of water flux, the amount of the force in a form of water which is coming out of the tube which is connected to the electric motor. Such like that, electric flux is also defined in the same way. But see the high. This is the conducting body. A charge is applied to the conducting body. Charge always expels out. This conducting body is divided into small infinitesimal 
areas like this. The total surface area of the conductor is S. Of conductor. Whenever a charge is placed inside the conductor, field lines always expels out. Because of the field lines are expelling out, it causes to the electric field. Means the some electric field lines are crossing a small portion of the conducting medium by making an angle of perpendicular that means the number of electric field lines which are crossing the conducting medium at an angle of 90 degrees is called electric flux let us say if the total surface area of this conductor is yes i am taking a small portion in this area can i say this small portion is ds and some electric field lines are also crossing through this ds there are many ds ds1 ds2 this is ds3 up to like dsn all collectives collectiveness of ds1 to dsn is called yes nothing but the total surface area of conductor the number of electric field lines which are passing through the unit surface area of a conducting medium at an angle of 90 degrees is called electric flux the definition is like this the number of electric field lines of force <coughs> which are passing through a unit surface area of a conducting body is called electric flux just try to visualize the electric flux what is the meaning of electric flux the number of field lines which are passing through the unit surface area of a conducting body by making an angle of 90 degrees the perpendicular angle is very very important that means the symbol of the electric flux is phi to eliminate the confusion it is the actual symbol of the electric flux electric field lines passing through unit surface area of the body if you remove the dot it is eds cos theta always the electric field lines and the surface are perpendicular to the each other therefore cos 90 is equal to 1 therefore phi e is equal to eds the value of this ds may change with respect to the shape of the conductor if it is a, a sphere what is the surface area of the sphere 4 pi r square if it is a, another medium or maybe a, a trapezium type model a cylindrical type model a triangular type model the surface area going to change e is not variable e is constant only this ds value is going to change so this is the concept of electric flux what is the unit of the electric flux unit of phi e is equal to it is nothing but e s where s is equal to total surface area or d s is also a small element of the total surface area electric field is newton for coulomb surface area is meter square or we can write volt per meter into meter square m and m square get cancelled volt meter The SI unit of electric flux is volt meter where V represents to volt, M represents meter. The next concept in the lesson is electric dipole and its related applications. What is electric dipole? Di means two, dipole means two poles. 
what is the arrangement of dipoles in the electric field we started the field lines from positive and ends at negative what is the dipole structure listen carefully there are two charges which are equal in magnitude but opposite in direction two equal and opposite charges which are separated by a finite distance the arrangement is called electric dipole two equal and opposite charges which are separated by a finite distance is called electric dipole the visualization of the electric pole is like this starts with the negative charge positive charge this is minus q this is plus q a dot a dot which represents the point charges these two charges are separated by a finite distance let us say 2a this q has some electric field plus q is also having some electric field the radius will be a and a therefore the distance between the plus q and minus q or minus q to plus q in the order of dipole is 2a then what is the magnitude of the charges q sign is different because it's a positive sign and negative sign the distance between the two charges is 2a this arrangement is called dipole what are the examples of the dipole yes if there is any physical name is there in the science there should be some examples electric dipole means two equal and opposite charges are separated by a distance so what are the examples best example for the electric dipole structure is magnet a magnet also having north pole and south pole the north pole always attracts the south south attracts towards the north it is high field potential this is low field strength this is high field strength low field strength this means two different fields are two opposite charges are separated by a finite distance because we can measure the length of the magnet so the distance is finite measurable not infinite and one more example atomic structure where the positive charge is located inside the nucleus the remaining negative charge is revolving around the nucleus means the distance from positive to negative charge is fixed so that's why this atomic structure is also called one of the example for the electric dipole any two charges which are separated in a finite way is called electric dipole these two are the well known examples for us the next point in the electric dipole is dipole momentum dipole momentum of electric dipole in any case there are three different types of momentum linear momentum which is in the mechanics angular momentum which is in the rotational dynamics this one dipole momentum which is in the electric charges yes we know that two charges are separated by a finite distance these two centers minus q plus q the distance between the charges is 2a or 2d 2x whatever it is our convenience dipole momentum symbol is p dipole moment or momentum what is the definition of dipole moment or momentum magnitude of charge into distance between the charges between charges
What is the magnitude of charge here? Q. Is it plus Q or minus Q? No problem. What is the distance between these two charges? 2A. Therefore, dipole momentum P is equal to 2AQ. This is one of the physical quantity where we can understand in the electrostatics or electric charges and fields. Now, for this physical quantity, we are going to discuss about the dimensions. Dimensions of dipole momentum is equal to 2A is the distance, Q is the charge. What is the SI unit of charge? Coulomb. What is the SI unit of the distance? Meter. C O U L O M B into meter. So the symbol is Coulomb meter. This Coulomb meter is the unit of the P, SI unit of the P, SI unit of P. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.